Hi, my name's Fred and this is my bar and these are my top five cider cocktails part two. If you like this video, give us a thumbs up and subscribe on the link below. And at the end of this video, look for all of our other bar and restaurant related videos. Thanks for watching. Next, okay, the next drink we are making this evening is called a bourbon maple cider. Oh, unbelievably good. A bourbon maple cider. Again, I'm gonna be using uh, the Maker's Mark bourbon. We're gonna put one and a half ounces, whoa, of bourbon in there. That's called alcohol abuse when you spill it like that. Let's just clean up my mess here. I always forget there's not a spigot or spout in that. We're also gonna use three quarters of an ounce of sour apple pucker. Then we are going to add the half ounce of maple syrup. Oh. Two dashes of bitters. And we are gonna to top with apple cider. Now, you could also top this with hard apple cider like a Angry Orchard or one of those but I prefer it with just regular apple cider. We are going to give this a good tumble to incorporate. And this drink is so good I'm shaking to drink it. And there you have your maple apple cider. Next drink is soon to be your most favorite fall drink. It is called a butterscotch cider, a butterscotch cider. What you're gonna need, now this is a very big glass. This is actually a 16 ounce uh, footed mug. So uh, you can get smaller glasses and the ratios will be different. But we're going to get some nice cider. Always shake your cider because it separates. We're going to actually put a cinnamon stick in the glass and we're gonna put about, I'd say 12 ounces of cider in the glass. And then we're gonna go take this we're gonna put it in the microwave for 30 seconds. We're gonna bring it up to about 165 degrees. So give me one second. I'm gonna grab this and I'll be right back. Okay, we just took it out of the microwave. It is now at about 165 degrees. You can let it sit for a second, but here's what's gonna really wow everybody. You're gonna add two ounces of butterscotch schnapps to this. I'm gonna pour that right in there. You can give it a little tumble just to incorporate, but remember your mixing tin will get hot. And there you have your butterscotch cider. Okay, this next drink is called the Apple Pumpkin Fizz, and it is delicious. The flavor profile on this drink is amazing. What you're gonna need is one and a half ounces of Jack Daniels honey. In addition to that, you're going to need a half ounce of your pumpkin liqueur. I don't have a jigger, uh, I'm using a jigger since I don't have a spout in this. Okay, half ounce. Then we are going to put three ounces of cider in this drink. And we are gonna to top it with some ginger beer. gonna give that a quick tumble to incorporate throw a couple apples in that and there you have your apple pumpkin fizz delicious okay the next drink we are making is called a caramel apple bourbon that's right a caramel apple bourbon what you're gonna need for this is we're gonna need an ounce and a half oh that looks pretty low we're gonna try to work with this an ounce and a half of the Jim Beam Apple Bourbon. And we, we're gonna give us a bonus on that, an ounce and a half, plus what's left in the, in the, uh, the bottle. And then we're gonna use a half ounce. Oh, I'm using uh, Lion's Caramel. Half ounce of the Lion's Caramel. And then we are gonna to top that with cider.
get a mixing tin and give this a good shake. Again, clean up your mess. They seem to be very messy this evening. It looks just like a caramel apple. Oh, we are going to garnish this with a few pieces of apple. And there you have your caramel apple bourbon. And it is delicious. Okay, and the next shot we're making this evening is called an Applejack shot. That's right, an Applejack shot. You're going to need your lovely rum chata. Again, you're just going to need a half ounce of rum chata. Put that into a mixing tin with ice. And then you're going to need a quarter ounce of the Frangelico. And then we are going to put a half ounce of apple juice. We're going to shake. and strain. And there you have your Applejack shot. Delicious. Hey, thanks for watching, we appreciate it. Again, if you like this video, give us a thumbs up, subscribe on the link below, and at the end of the video, which is right now, please look for all of our other bar and restaurant related videos. Again, thanks for watching.